The oppositionless government in the state held a crucial consultative meeting with civil society organizations and tribal hohos in Chumukedima today after the center's decision to reduce the ambit of AFSPA in seven districts of the state. The crucial meeting, which was held at the Rhododendron Hall in Chumukedima, was attended by Chief Minister Nephew Rio, Deputy Chief Minister Y. Patton, and other top leaders of the state government. Talking to media persons after the meeting, Chairman of the United Democratic Alliance government in Nagaland, T. R. Zeliang, said that while the meet welcomed the move to reduce the ambit of AFSPA, it was also decided to find ways and means to take things forward from here. D.R. Zeliang also informed that everyone wants AFSPA to be lifted entirely from the state. Consultative meeting on the Armed Forces Special Powers Act and this meeting is coming after the government of India had announced its decision to reduce some of the um, uh, areas from the ambit of AFSPA. So uh, what were the main points of discussion into this consultative meeting and how crucial is this meeting? Yeah, we have had a uh, good sitting free and frank discussion because all are of the view that this uh, lifting of APSPA in some district partial lifting and in some district full uh, fully lifted we welcome the idea but uh, we exchange the idea how to take it forward so if we implement for example like the ceasefire ground rule with the people, the people, government, and the uh, police. If government and the people support the police, so we can implement this uh, ceasefire ground rules in Toto. So the question of, uh, see, reimposing this as part of the standard height. So we decided to cooperate with each other and take it forward so that the remaining area also slowly, it will go on the the uh, diminishing return and at the end of the day the whole state may be the, uh, done away with this ASPA so that is the hope if people people and the government work together so what kind of mechanism are you as the state government going to put in place to ensure that this uh, this implementation is successful and that there's no room for the government of India to impose this AFSPA again in these areas? That is why, as I said, the state police, we have about 20,000 forces. Those people now, they have, they, they have uh, re strengthened their forces in all the police station. So with this, uh, our own forces, if we can implement the ceasefire ground rule, there is no question of reimposing this uh, APSPA in our state. Meanwhile, Nagahoho President H.K. Zimomi said that AFSPA should be repealed in its entirety from the state of Nagaland. We have uh, already spoken of our views. And then the, I think uh, today's meeting was very fruitful because including the state government, even though partial lifted of the AFSPA, is appreciated still when there is no problem in the state we all agree that uh, the aspa should be completely removed from the peaceful state and meanwhile nsf president k tep said that he was shocked to see naga leaders accepting the piecemeal approach towards afspa repeal today i am dismayed and I was shocked to see many Naga leaders accepting the peace meal uh, given by the government of India by lifting certain portion or jurisdiction of uh, Nagaland particularly and in the entire Naga homeland uh, because we are living in a democratic country where government of India or so to say mighty India considered as the largest democratic country in the world. When we talk about uh, Naga political movement and uh, dialogue, talk is in the process. Naga, Naga people are living in a very peaceful manner where Nagaland as well as entire Naga homeland does not merit uh, ASPA. This draconian law for so long it exists in our Naga homeland. 
Naga Students Federation, as we represent the aspirations of the Naga youths and students, we will ensure that uh, as we have directed our federating units, that we will not cooperate any uh, Indian militaries and uh, we ensure that Naga people will not uh, accept any humanitarian act from uh, the Indian forces or Indian armies and uh, we will continue to fight until and unless ASPA is repealed or is lifted from the entire Naga homeland. Well, it may be mentioned here that the Cognac Union abstained from the consultative meeting on AFSPA. The decision has been taken by the union in solidarity with the victims of the infamous Oting tragedy. Moreover, the Cognac Union has also reiterated its demand to book all personnel involved in the Oting massacre in the court of law, bring the report in the public domain and table the SIT report. The union has also sought for a complete removal of AFSPA from the Naga inhabited areas.